What's up, what's up? It's your boy, Pokey J Mart. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, guys. We are going to be opening up over... Well, let's do the math on that. Yeah, over 40 booster packs of Burning Shadows. We got ourselves a booster box up front. And then we got those little blister pack things from Walmart, which you got the promo. And a little coin action. And then, another one. Same thing, but with the Alolan Meow promo. And the first one was the Cosmog promo. Um, again, we are trying to collect all the X and Y promos, so that's why I bought those. Alright, so we'll be doing those last. And we are shooting for, obviously, we're on the hunt for the Rainbow Rare Charizard. Like everybody else. Alright. Um, I definitely enjoy this set. Um, I don't I don't know why. Um, I mean, I like them all. I mean, I'd, I'd probably say the one I was disappointed in the most was Base Set Sun and Moon. Um, I, I don't know. Maybe because it, it just, you know, featured just a lot of the standard Sun and Moon guys. I don't really like any of those dudes. Obviously, you got my boy Ho on the front. Um, here's the back. Let's crack it open. There it is. Um, again, I just, I just, I just like, you know, I love Ho. And I'm not a huge Charizard fanboy like a lot of other people out there. Trust me, a lot of fanboys out there. Fanboy for Charizard. Um, do I want the Rainbow Rare Charizard? Absolutely. Who doesn't? Um, it's only, you know, it's only going to stay, you know, either stay at a good price point or, or, or only go up. It'll just be a kind of rare item at the, at the end of the day. I'm like a too from that. Anyway, so, um, let's just crack, you know, let's just get a crack of lack in here, guys. Let's, let's light this candle. Let's poke these balls, um, as they say. <laughs> anyway. Um, I'm trying to think how I want to do this. Let's this off the side, I guess. Alright. Let's get it going. Let's get it on. Let's get it on. We are not going to be doing Patrick in effort of saving some time this evening. Tynamo, a Dusko, an NK, a Merrill. Ooh, bro, we started off with a banger. With a banger. Ooh, a four supporter trainer card. Four Kawe. <whistles> Buddy, search your deck for up to four fire energy cards. Attach them to one of your Pokemon. Then shuffle your deck. Your turn ends. This card is on fire, as they say. Alright. What's her face would be proud? Alright. Alicia Keys. For all those who couldn't figure out what I was talking about. Alright, guys. Whew! What a banger! What a banger. Um I guess we are gonna take the time to sleeve these as we go. Alright, so we we effectively banged out our full art trainer card. So I'm going to go ahead and say that we're probably not going to get any more of those. Um, the rest of these packs. Who knows? Maybe we'll get another one. But again, if we could just get a secret rare 24 karat gold and a, a preferably a rainbow rare on top of what we just got, I would be happy as I'll get a reverse Pikachu and a... Standard Art Mar Shadow GX. I'm actually kind of glad I got this because the other day on eBay, I tried to bid for, bid for a lot on that, and I lost. And I, ironically enough, said, wouldn't it be crazy if I pulled a Mar Shadow? And I did. All right, um, we got a Mar Shadow GX. Would have been nice to get the Rainbow. Rainbow. But at the end of the day, guys, I would trade any standard GX or any regular Rainbow Rare. Or a Charizard Rainbow Rare. Because that's what we want here, fellas. Guys and gals. Alright, well, the first two packs were absolutely bangers. It's amazing. And I think this one's... Uh, no, okay. We got Alana. Heal 50 damage for each of your Pokemon that has a water energy attached to it. That's kind of cool. And our first non-hollow regular rare. Scolipede. Okay, my Guzma. Not bad, not bad. Definitely setting a good uh, good tone. 
Now, the only other problem is you might run into where you start off really strong in the beginning. You know, you're just pulling bangers every pack, and then, like, the last half is absolutely terrible. We shall see, said the mind man. All right, we got a pan pour. Mudbray and a is it a hollow a hollow duskmore duskmore? I don't think I've seen that card yet. I've yet to pull that. Mind Jack, 150 HP. That's pretty hot. All right, moving on. And as always, a code card. There you be. We pulled out a banger. The Kiawe. Dude, that's awesome, dude. I cannot believe I pulled that. I'm just so glad it wasn't a, a double, a McDouble. A Rotom Dex. Finder Mode Reverse. Ooh, and a Salazzle GX. A Salazzle Dazzle, baby. Yeah. Alright, that's going to be a dub, I think. I'll double, double it, and double it again. Alright, I'll double. I've just been, you know, I've been so excited to open this, like, all day. Only because, again, only because, you know, the chance of pulling that, the chance of pulling that big, bad rainbow rare. That's all we really want, folks. I mean, any rainbow rare I'd be okay with. Reverse Lycan Rock and a Weevil. For the rainbow rare. And a weakness policy. Alright. Next pack. Let's do it. So Lazzle Dazzle, give me some magic. Meowth, my homie. Hook me up, buddy. A reverse Sneasel. The Hollow Get a Dose. Yo, I gotta say what, this first this first half is just crushing. We got the two hollows, the two GXs and a full art. All in the first. All in the first stack. The first half of the first stack. That's not saying much for the last half. It amazes me how that happens. Oddish, Magikarp, and the Slow King regular rare. Wish they would have made that a hollow. I'd be I'd be down with that. I would be down with that. Absolutely. Rudity. Oh buddy. Man, we are just pulling all the good cards out of this first pack. We got a reverse weevil. <sighs> buddy. Buddy. Alright. More than likely we're not getting the rainbow rare. But we did pull a Salazzle. Oh buddy, it's getting a little slippery. Oh, I thought that was a bonus card. A Salazzle Rainbow Rare. A Salazzle Dazzle Rainbow Rare, dude. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Probably would have preferred a, a different one, but I'll take it. I'll take it. This is not a double. I never pulled this card before. I've never, I've never pulled a rainbow rare up until right now. So, always gonna remember my first. Always remember your first time, as they say. As they say. <laughs> anyway, I'd like to quick take a quick commercial break. Um, I would like to add that I purchased this booster box, uh, Burning Shadows, Sun and Moon, uh, from a Ryan Fouts, uh, currently located in Lancaster, Pennsylvania, Lancaster County. If you are in that area and you happen to watch my content or share my content to someone that knows maybe close by to Lancaster County, Pennsylvania, uh, he is my current main dealer at this point in time. Um, we've officially decided that, that he is going to be my main man, my main dude, my main brosif, and I'm going to buy a majority of my content from him with the occasional pack, you know, from Walmart here and there to kind of fill the void in the meantime. But um, he's known as uh, PA Collectibles, uh, PA as in Pennsylvania, uh, PA Collectibles. You can go ahead and Facebook that or Google that. And that should pop right on up. Uh, you can also look in my description uh, in this particular video at the bottom, the com the right, you know, right, right above the comments, the description section. It will list PA Collectibles and the link and some of his information. And from there, you can find out uh, prices and uh, content and what he has in stock currently. Uh, currently, it's mostly all modern day stuff, all stuff that have come out in the last, um, you know, six months to the year, as well as any current stuff coming out. Uh, he's getting the Shining Legends 
uh, slightly before the uh, release in store. So if you're looking for that extra three to four day uh, release, you know, hit him up. Um, stand by. Oh, look at that. That's kind of cool. A reverse Kingdra with a Hollow Kingdra. I feel like they do that deliberately. Like they gotta know they're doing that, right? They have to know. Anyway, uh, back to what I was saying. And um, he's got some older content in stock. Um, but again, that might be a little more than what it originally was when it originally MSRP'd. Only because obviously everything goes up in price as it goes along, depending if there's a market for it. Uh, but anyway, PA Collectibles, Ryan Fowl, Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. Um, hit him up, look him up, click on the link below, and hook you up. Hopefully, with some good deals. Kerbomino, and a Malamar, and a Code Card. Right. You know, I just I wish I could hire somebody that literally just card maintenance is the whole time I'm doing this. Um, that's got to be one of the most frustrating things about this. Uh, reverse Simus here. And the regular Lady Din. Gen 2. Salazzle Dazzle, baby. Salazzle and Dazzle. But yes, anyway. And, you know, I hate, you know, I hate going through stacks and figuring out all the, you know, all the, the, um, verses and then pull them out. Amount. Uh, Alana Killa, a Lily Kanama, and a Tangrowth. You know, for the longest time, I never realized they made they gave him a evolution. I'm actually a little mad about that. It's terrible looking. El Terrible, por favor. Inskino, Inskino on Volcanenda. A Feliz Navidad. Buenas noches, Adat. Pants here as the reverse. And a stupid mud covered horse. Excellente. Excellente. Ponyo. Alright. We got a Steffel. Ooh, we got a Salafiki. Sof. Sophocles? No idea. No idea. Ooh, we got the uh, Hollow Dark Ride. That's kind of cool. That is kind of cool. If your opponent has already used their GX attack in the stack, they take more damage. And plus, now my question is, does that hold for the rest of the game? So if your opponent has already used their GX attack, can I then use Dark Raid for 160 every single time I attack? I don't know, but if somebody wants to comment and post and link to the content on that or let me know, that'd be fantastic. Because if so, this move could be half decent. However... I don't know how often GX moves are actually used. So that'd be the other thing. Now, if you're going up against a, a card, a GX card that often is used for the GX move, you'd probably be alright. Oh, we got the reverse Dark Cry. And we just pulled the hollow Dark Cry. And a Bruxus as the regular rare. Okay. Alright, we have an Inke. Sorry, I'm starting to open off camera here, guys. Apologies. Uh, and a Butterfree, and a Bye Bye Butterfree. And Bye Bye Butterfree. Okay, he's gone. He is out of here, guys. He went bye bye. He went bye bye. As my dog likes to do. Okay. Alright, guys. Um, we're definitely slowing down here a little bit. Um, we got two GXs, a rainbow, and a four. So I'm thinking we should get two more GXs. And I'm hoping, I'm really hoping for that secret rare because um, I've seen people pull a rainbow, a four, and a secret all in one. Mm. Gardevoir GX. Okay. I think I have every single. I feel like I have every single regular standard GX now um, in this set. I feel like I do because that's definitely going to be a double again. Um, I actually just got rid of a Gardevoir GX today, uh, earlier, so, um, I don't know. Basically has the same, it's basically like the Mewtwo attack, that 30x move right there. Uh, what's that called? Infinity, Infinity Force? If it had ever actual focus. Basically like the Mewtwo attack. Hmm. Alright. Cool. Would have been nice to be the fort. You know what I mean? Jelly bean? 
All right, I'm, I'm a little concerned. We have a lot of packs left. A lot of packs left. So my guess is a lot of these are going to be duds, which is a darn root and toot and shame. Panpour and Azuma roll. Azuma roll, Azuma roll. As your mom. Almost would behoove me just to not even open the rest and just sell them off. I hate to say it. I thought about it, guys. I definitely thought about it. Ooh, a reverse Shinotic. I've never seen that card. Baller. Is that any good? Hmm. Pissimian. I don't think I've seen that card either. Okay. And a code card. Guys, where's that secret rare that we need? It would be nuts is if this box had two rainbows in it, which I don't know if that's ever happened. I'm sure it's happened to somebody. Um, I've never seen it happen on video. Yeah, that one lucky guy gets two rainbows, or it's like a, it's like a, it's like an air box. They've already they doubled up on the rainbows. And a reverse Raichu and a regular Red Bruxish and a code. Look cool. who. Alright, yeah, that's what I said, man. Ooh, buddy, these last... We just gotta hit that last GX yet. And I'm thinking probably another hollow. Definitely another hollow coming. A Mudsdale. I'm sorry. Oh, guys. Jacked it up. And two card. Okay. <clears throat> Yep, there's the hollow we were just talking about. Reverse seizure and a hollow palace sand. I must have pulled that card like ten times now. The palace sand that is. Okay. Hmm. I didn't want this last GX said that. I just I could have Yeah, I didn't just sold all the packs off. <whistles> Almost shoulda. I've never had that happen where um I've literally pulled all the good cards in the first half. I've seen people do that, where, like, if they basically put all the good cards, like, minus one, they just saw the rest of the packs. I mean, at that point, you're really not, you're, it's almost like, you know, that you, 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 you're solid, you're squared away, you have all the good ones. Ooh, Hollow Raichu, the reverse Lichen Rock. I don't know if I have that. I think I do. Well, who's in the background? Oh, Grogon. Okay, 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 okay. A little bit of Po-Town, Po-Town, downtown. Piece of big hand thing. Right, come on, baby. Where's this last GX at? Where you at, buddy? Ooh, a heat more reverse and electros. Regular rare. Where's this at? I'm kinda hoping with so many packs left, we gotta be getting another cool that would be nice. Rainbow secret. Come on, buddy. Come on, give me something. Give me something. Reverse scared is and a regular rare hand cross. Oh, buddy. Oof, I got excited. I thought, oh man, I got excited. I thought, all right, the Krasma GX. Not bad. Again, I think I have all the standard GX now at this point. So really any GX card I get is going to be a dub. All right. Now the question is, do I open up the rest? Do I open up the rest? I don't know. I do not know. Because... I'm pretty sure I pulled all the good cards. What do we got left? Yeah, we got five left. Right. Hold off on that. So we got. Do I have all the GXs pulled? Yeah. Four GXs, a rainbow, and a. This and uh, a floor. Yep, that's got to be it, guys. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Might hold off. Shame I had to go through all those. I would have packed upon that GX then. I'm not going to show that off too much. It is a Cosmog, 60 HP, and it's X and Y 42. Uh, 42.
Jesus. Yeah, oh my god, look at my desk here, guys. It's just so many cards. So many cards. Insane. Oof. Oof. Ooh, was that what I think it was? Oh, God. Please, dude. Please. Oh, man. I got a little excited. Sometimes I, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I think it's a rainbow rare. Ooh, a Machan GX. My homie. My homie. I take it back. That's the only GX I actually was missing. This one. All right, buddy. All right, buddy. I don't know why I thought that was a rainbow. It just looked like a rainbow rare on this on the edging. Where I pulled it. My champ GX. My boy. My boy. I'm, I'm pretty pumped about that. I'm pretty pumped. Um, I did not have that card. I actually completely forgot about it. But I'm like 99% positive I have them all now. Um, Alright, guys. I'm getting confused here. I don't know if I just showed this. I apologize. Just double check. See if it's the same one. Um, let's do it again. Let's do it again. So, I don't know. I doubt there's probably going to be anything good in the rest of these now. Ooh, Hollow Rhyperior and a Reverse Dust Clops. That Hollow is going to be new, I think. The Hollow. Okay. Another code. Another Salazzle Dazzle. And then, all right, not bad. So we're two for three out of this little three pack list here. That is good in my book. Good in my book. Bodybuilding Dumbbells. And I beware. There you be. And it's gone. Almost gone. And it's gone. Okay, on to the last little blister pack then. Got a hook on the back. Okay. Again, that's going to be the alone of Meowth. It's got 60 HP and it's X and nope, Sun and Moon 43. Ha! X and Y. Come on now. Who are we talking about? All right, hopefully we get some legit pulls in this too. It's phenomenal. Horsey and a Meowth stick. Versus the regular. Okay. Um, tomorrow I will be, if everything goes to plan, everything goes to plan, I will be doing a pre-release, uh, box opening, single, one of those mini box openings of Shining Legends, so stay tuned for that, I'm pumped to see what I got out of that, absolutely pumped, I love me some Shining Legends sets, and a turt, and a turdy nerd. And a turt and nerd. A turdy nerdy. Alright, so far, this little blister has not been the best. But what are you gonna do? Alright, a electric and a bruxish. Mmm. Terrible. That first one was on fire. Definitely on fire though, that first one. Alright, let me see what we got here. Let's do some quick. Um What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Let's just crack that. Let's crack it. Let's crack it. Let's crack them. See what happens. It's probably just gonna be a hollow. Gave an off chain. No, but you know what, though? Dude, there could be a secret rare. Yeah, there, oh, I've seen that happen. Mm, definitely could be a secret rare in these. Guess we'll find out. Guess we will find out. And Olivia, reverse, and a turdy nerd. And a turdy nerd. Alright, come on, baby. Secret rare, dude. I mean, this box, if I get a full art, a rainbow, and a secret rare, this is going to be the box, dude. I see it happen all the time for other guys. Oh, man. I'm going to be mad if these last five packs are terrible. Hmm. 
Ooh. We just got him next year. Okay, okay. Reverse Super Scoop Up. And a Tapu Finny GX. Standard. Not bad. Alright, so that's kind of what, you know, there was, we definitely knew, I mean, I had a, a feeling that there was going to be something else. I figured it'd be a hollow, but in the off chance, it was a secret. Um, that's going to leave us with minus the Machamp. I'll have to, I'll have to count that then. Champ. Now, I would just absolutely poop myself if, if there was a secret rare in this yet. Arachnid. Arachnid. That would be antsy. The reverse the code card. Alright, now this last pack is probably going to be nothing. If I had to guess, it's going to be a hollow. Also, Lazzle Dazzle Hollow. A Malamar. Mmm, and a Carbomidal. I should have not opened that last pack. Something was telling me. Right, I'm kind of glad I opened that, but kind of not. Alright guys, uh, it's been a Burning Shadows, um, hope you enjoyed yourself, I definitely did, we definitely pulled some legit cards, I think real quick, we're at 26 minutes, um, I'm going to sh showcase some stuff real quick, um, we got the special jumbo cards from Japania, uh, I've known about these cards pretty much ever since I was a kid, I just never got around to get them, um, they're not the best condition, uh, I was a little disappointed, and now I see why they're so cheap, um, anyway, um, a lot of the promo jumbos, um, you know, they, they started doing this in the, obviously in English. Every time you get a box set, you get a, you know, you know, um, you know, prime example, you know, Mega Mawali X, uh, you know, jumbo card. You know, those are dumb. Uh, these, these are different. These are, these are definitely better in my opinion. This is from the Pokemon movie. Um, this is the dude that's trying to collect all the legendaries and trying to get Lugia. Um, Articuno, Moltres, Zapdos. And speaking of those three. This is the three bird card, um, the elemental three bird card. It does 200 damage. Again, it's a promo. I actually had this in English as well. Um, I, I thought my English card was beat up. Let me tell you, a uh, base set Charizard jumbo promo. It's got the little promo, little dude in the symbol there. Um, promo Pika. Um, I don't know, like Vacation Pikachu. Who knows? I used to know the names. Um, say the best one for last. Um, again, another Pikachu. Um, these are like um, these like Play-Doh, like Play-Doh claymation, all claymation. Another promo, and this one's sweet. Look at this one. This one is the Mewtwo. This one's from the movie. You got the battle of Mewtwo and Mew, and Pika in the background, be like, "Oh my God!" You got the, "Oh my God!" Oh my, oh my God! Oh my God! Face in the back. You see that? You just chilling in the front, fighting off his nemesis. That's a good one. I love this one. It's a good one. I just wish they were mint. They're not mint. I don't know why. Um, we'll, we'll crack open this tap of cocoa. In the off chance, we go ahead and pull something legit. Like a, uh, you know, everybody's fan favorite right now. A Tapu Lele. Pull that Tapu Lele, son. That would be sweet. You got the Tapu Coco GX promo Sun and Moon 33. Okay. You got yourself an Island Guardians 10 Tapu Coco code card. I assume you get the promo. Okay. And unfortunately, we get an Evolutions pack in this. I'm not too thrilled about um, I'd only be thrilled if, in fact, it held a. Four Mega Charizard EX. That'd be about the only way I'd be happy. Two Guardian Rising, an Evo, and a Steam Siege. Now, if every pack was on fire, I'd be happy. Now, this needs to be a Full Art Volcanian for me to really care. Come on, baby. Full Art Volcanian. Where's that? Alright. A regular rare Pyroar. Dumb. Card War Spirit Link. And a code card. I'm gonna go Evo. Come on, baby. Come on. How hard is it? How hard is it for me to get a four mega? Rotata. <sighs> Electroid. Secret Ray. <clears throat> Lame, bruh.
All right, baby. We're gonna do some GR. We're gonna do the GR. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Let's hope we get something legit. A Victini reverse and a Hunch Crow regular rare. Okay. Not so much. Not so much. Not so much. Okay. We got one more, baby. Uh, I mean, really anything. Just a GX, Rainbow Secret. You know, come on, Tapu Fin. You know, a Tapu Lele. Tapu Lele. Uh, a Lampant and a Gothitella. <laughs> Lame. Lame, 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 Kind of glad of it. All right, guys. Well, um, it's been baller. I mean, overall, um, we managed to get do a quick recap. We'll end the video. Um, all right. So minus the Machamp. So let me quick organize these. Okay. Put that at the end. Right, Machamp. All right. So. We got the Machamp GX. Okay, that was out of that little blister thing. So minus that, we ended up getting Tapu Fini, the Krasma GX, Gardevoir GX, Salazzle GX, Marshadow GX. So that's going to be five GXs, which I think it's what averages about four usually. So that's pretty sweet. And then a four Cowway, which is awesome because it's brand new. And the Salazzle Dazzle GX Rainbow Rare, baby. Mm -mm -mm. God, it's a beaut. I saw, I could tell this was a rainbow when we were pulling it. And like, I had this brief moment, this brief moment. I'm like, oh my God, it's going to be the charts. <laughs> but it wasn't. All right. Um, appreciate you guys watching. We're going to be doing the English version of this tomorrow. If everything goes well, we'll be doing at least three packs of that plus the promo. And then we'll probably be doing the Espeon GX box tomorrow and maybe a 10. So that should be a good, that'd be a nice, well-rounded video. I'm pretty pumped. All right, guys, like, comment, share, subscribe. As always, I appreciate the views and the likes and the comments. Whatever you want to do, let's keep this fan base going. Um, as always, we get a bigger, better, bigger, better views, all that jazz. We're going to do some more and more giveaways. As before, we already gave away the Tapu Coco way back in the day. And, um... Yeah, we got that one lucky guy that actually decided, hey, you know what? I'm going to participate in the giveaway. Boom, that guy got it. Um, anyway, so, uh, yeah, appreciate it, guys. Thanks, Deuce.